Um, I mean, it means it means everything. You know, I've been waiting. Uh, I think like 17 games now for for just you know a game, and I know it's not going to be easy. Bondi's been doing great, um, and we've been pushing each other every training session. So uh, he's made me a better goalkeeper. I've made him hopefully a better goalkeeper. Um, and for me, it was just waiting, you know, for this chance and uh, and taking it. Um, so I'm happy. I'm happy I could help the team win. I mean, it's it's all you can really ask for is to get those three points away from home and then be able to come home and, and start this tough week now, um, you know, where we did, you know, rest some players and, and be able to attack the next game on, on Wednesday. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's a, it was a good game. It was a fun game. It was, it was nice to be out there. Uh, uh, yeah. So. I, I mean, you talked about it a little bit. Getting three points is obviously important. And uh, you guys moved to first, even though maybe momentarily uh, SKC still plays a little bit later here. Um, what does being at first place, even if it's, you know, a snapshot in time right now, what does that mean to this team um, that's, that's been working hard towards climbing that ladder? Uh, it means, uh, again, it means a lot. I mean, we, I think we are a very confident group and we set our, uh, our, our sights pretty high. You know, our goals are pretty high. Um, and to be able to say, hey, you know, even if it is, like you said, momentary, momentarily, it's a huge boost of confidence for us um, because we know we can, we can stay there. We know we can be there. We know we can compete with any team in the MLS. Um, and yeah, like I said, it's a huge boost of confidence uh, going into the week as well as in the second half of the season. Um, so I think we'll take this and, and run and, and see how far we can go with it. So perfect. Congratulations on the Wednesday travels. Appreciate it. Thanks, Josh. We will go with Jonathan Sigal with MLS Soccer. Jonathan, go ahead. Uh, Jonathan, the Jonathan here. Um, what has it been like for you since you've come back uh, stateside, being here with the Galaxy and MLS? I mean, these, these chances for you haven't come often, um, but tonight was obviously a statement of sorts for, for you of a guy that domestically people tracked overseas and then he returns back home. Um, what is this, I don't know, the exact timeline, but year, give or take, been like for you? Um, I, like I said before, um, Bondi came in and he started playing well. Um, and for me, it was just more motivation to, to keep training um, because a goalkeeper is a difficult, difficult position. You can't get subbed out randomly in the 72nd minute and then get, you know, a little bit of, of time. So it's just working hard and, and, and staying confident. And um, uh, I mean, since I got back, uh, it's, it's been, it's been pretty nice. Um, just being able to, to not have to focus on anything off the field. You know, you kind of have all those things. Uh, you're at home, you know, you have your family, you have your friends, which I didn't have for, for three years in Europe and which was always tough for me. So I felt like this was the best situation for me to, to advance as, a, as an athlete. Um, and so coming back, I've definitely improved. I've had two great goalkeeper coaches uh, since I've been here, learned so much from each of them um, and just, just keep training and, and, and keep, you know, keep going. So that's, that's all I can really say. And just one more quick for me would be, we've seen sometimes for backup goalkeepers in MLS, it's hard to come in and be sharp right away. There's maybe a few nervy moments at first, um, but you of course make that early save. You didn't really show any of that. What was that moment for you? Like, I imagine that's kind of like, okay, I, I, I kind of feel comfortable right now. Yeah, there was definitely some nerves. I mean, like I said, a bit, uh, it's I think it's the 18th game or something like that, or in the second part of the season. Um, and it could could have came at any any point in, in the season. It could have been the second game, third game. You never really know. And so for it to be to be now, you just had to be ready. Um, and that save, like you said, in the in the first couple of minutes, really really helped me. Um, so it was it was it was nice to have. I was pretty pumped after that save, uh, and uh, it gave me the confidence I needed to go forward. We'll go with Katia Castorena with ESPN next. Go ahead, Katia. Thanks, Vicky. Hi, Jonathan. You mentioned it at first about how um, you've improved things to Bondi and that you've kind of helped each other out. So if you can like talk a little bit more about that and what it's meant for you having him in the team and how he has helped you. Um, yeah, I mean, it's always good to have competition. Um, and especially when you're when you're the second um, right now, it's it's, you know, climbing to the first. Uh, and yeah, I mean, we, we, we push each other in training all the time. Um, and I think we've been beneficial for, for each other, uh, as well as, as Hardy and, um, 
and the other keepers in, in the group. I think we've all improved. We all keep improving. Um, and obviously my goal is to, to not be on the bench anymore. Um, so I, I hope I did as much as I could today. Um, and just to, to keep going forward and hopefully take that starting, starting spot, hopefully. Thank you. We'll go one, one last question with Larry Morgan. Larry, go ahead. Hi, Jonathan. Thanks for taking our, our questions. I have a two-part question. One, the obvious one is, when did you get word that you would start this game and were you surprised when you did get word? Did you have a feeling it might happen? And two, how, how satisfying is it for the defense to get a clean sheet, especially at a difficult place to play like this? Um, I got it a couple of days ago uh, that I was um, training with the, with the first squad uh, in training. Uh, I actually didn't really tell anyone that no one knew that I was playing today. Uh, I didn't want any uh, uh, congratulations texts before the game. So no one, I still haven't talked to anyone. So my dad's probably pissed. Um, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I just kind of took it and, and kind of had tunnel visions. Like I got to play well, I got to play well. Um, and yeah, I, you know, um, I think I had a good game and uh, we'll move forward. And what was the second, the second part of the question? How satisfying was it for the defense, spearheaded by you, of course, to get this clean sheet in a difficult place to play like Allianz Field? I mean, first that the stadium is, is, is awesome. I really enjoyed playing here. Um, and for us to get, like you said, a shutout here is, is, is even more satisfying. Um, you know, I don't think we've, I don't know, I think we've gotten a couple of shutouts this season, but every single one gives us like more and more confidence to, to keep moving forward, gives more and more confidence to the defense, whoever's playing, um, because we know that we can, we can get those shutouts and we know that our forwards are going to do their jobs and our midfielders as well, because um, we're, we're, we're a damn good team and we can go far. So everything we can do, whether it be shutouts, whether it be scoring as many goals as possible, um, it's 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 a it's a step in the right path, step in the right direction, and just to just to keep going, keep getting more, keep getting more wins, and then uh, yeah, see how far we can go.